Welcome, in this video we will learn about the label encoding. We do label our training data with the words so that mapping can be tracked. To convert word labels into numbers, we need to use label encoder. Label encoding refers to the process of transforming the word labels into numerical form. This enables the algorithm to operate on our data. If you don't get this definition, then leave it, forget it. Let me show you by executing this Python script what it really means. So let's open already developed script that is label encoding.py and let's see the output. Let's open the terminal and change directory to desktop. Run the command as python space label encoding.py you can see the output is label mapping the black is labeled to 0 green is labeled to 1 and so on up to yellow it's 4 and for the labels green red and black the encoded values are 1 2 0 so we have just asked output from the computer by shuffling the colors so it is giving the right encoded values that is 1 to 0 and in the same way by just giving encoded values that is 3 0 4 1 it is giving out decoded labels that is white black yellow green you can see here the white is 3 and black is 0 and so on so in this way for the labels we have encoded these numbers that is 0 1 2 3 4 for labels we have asked encoded values it has given out and for encoded values it has given out decoded labels so this is label encoding let's see the python script of this one i hope you got by seeing that example what that definition means where i mentioned that transforming the word labels into numerical form and this enables the algorithm to operate on our data. So let's see label encoding.py script. So the first one import numpy as np. numpy is a fundamental package for scientific computing with python. Next from sklearn import preprocessing a set of python module for machine learning and data mining. Next, sample input labels are declared, that is input labels red, black, red, green, black, yellow, white, that is all these colors are the input labels. Next, create a label encoder using object encoder, so encoder equals to preprocessing dot label encoder. And fit the labels through my input labels, that is encoder dot fit input labels. Now we can relate the output and the code. For example, here I will print my mapping message here that is print label mapping. If I show you output back here again, you can see in the output label mapping was written. You can see in the output label mapping. And again back to the code. Next we want the color and its values assigned. So for that you can see in the output black 0, green 1 and so on. So for that I will use for loop that is for i item in enumerate encoder dot classes print item i with this symbol that is assigning symbol. So we will print the label with the value. So the output will look like this, that is black 0, green 1, red 2, white 3, yellow 4. Now what output I had showed was labels, that is we will give them labels, that is green, red, black and it should give us encoded value as output. So now let's do it. So here I am creating the object as test labels equals to green, red, black will encode a set of label using the encoder encoded values is equal to encoder dot transform test labels 
print the test label list and encoded value list type print labels equals to test labels print encoded values equals to list encoded value so this print statement will give us this output that is labels equals to green red black and the encoded values are 1 to 0 now let's get back to the code so now what we want is we'll give encoded values and it should give us decoded labels that is for numerical number it should give us what color we want that is you already seen in output if you want just see output again for 3041 what color is assigned that is for that we'll define the values for encoding that is encoded values equals to 3041 now let's decode a set of values using encoder so decoded list equals to encoder dot inverse transform encoded values now let's print decoded values and labels with assigned values that is print encoded values encoded values print decoded labels list decoded list so this kind of output it should give that is encoded values 3041 decode labels should be white black yellow green so now the code is done so let's execute it again let's see the output you already seen it but anyhow let's see it again open the terminal change directory to desktop run the command as python label encoding dot py you can see my encoded mapping is correct with the values and also decoding values are correctly mapped you can check the mapping to see that encoding and decoding steps are correct so that's it what you have to understand about label encoding and what encoding and decoding happen inside a script i hope you got it if not please do watch the video again i believe that the label encoding concept is very much clear for you after this video so that's it in this video thank you for watching this video